Hi everyone, thanks for watching my YouTube content. I'm Sang Kim. Today, I would like to show you how to uh, estimate parameters for multivariate normal distribution by max maximum likelihood method. There is one reference site I've used for this video, and this is typical log likelihood function. In our program, actually, I'm going to use mvnorm.mre function. And if you see a, the logic of mvnorm.mre function, and this function use uh, log likelihood function format uh, as a simpler, I mean, much simpler format because it doesn't calculate these parts. Instead of this formula, you use n uh, times d. Uh, n means number of uh, samples and d is number of variables. So this one is much simpler form uh, compared to this uh, typical log likelihood function. Anyway, let me show you uh, how to calculate this part and then I will compare this part uh, result of this one and this one. Right. As you can see, This is our program to estimate uh, parameters by uh, maximum likelihood method and it shows log likelihood and estimated mu and sigma from samples. Right. So mm, let me initially uh, uh, set uh, uh, mu as such as like one, right? Instead of using actual uh, sample average, then we can uh, standardize this data to calculate this one. So row data, first column, sepal length uh, minus average of uh, sepal lengths. I mean, it's not actual uh, average of sepal lengths, initial value for sepal lengths. Then we can apply this formula for other cells. Okay. Then we can calculate uh, inside of this part. So once you calculate this one, we, you can sum up uh, all these values, then you can get uh, total uh, value for this formula, right? So let's get this part first. So merge. Uh, instead of uh, because of data structure, we don't need to transpose data first. So this one standardized data and comma and inverse of uh, sigma matrix part here. Uh, press F4 to fix it. And again, and merge. Transpose of this one and press Ctrl Shift Enter. Right, let's get a uh, sigma mat uh, matrix first. I mean, uh, this one now uh, we can use a merge and transpose of standardized data and comma. Standardize the data again, close and divide by a number of samples. Because uh, we want to estimate uh, population sigma, so that's why we don't uh, divide by n minus 1, we divide it by n. And press uh, Ctrl Shift Enter. Right. Then you can apply this uh, formula for other samples okay then let's get this one uh, sum of values here right this is uh, 120 so it's uh, there are 30 samples times four variables right so this means that n times d is equal to sum of this formula, right? Let's use uh, this formula uh, for uh, to calculate log likelihood. 
uh, minus negative uh, 1 over 2 times uh, n times k sorry times k times log of 2 times pi I extracted this part so plus uh, sorry times log of determinant of zero matrix uh, plus this one right then uh, let's use uh, server to find best I mean uh, optimal mu mu and sigma so we need to set objective for this cell and we want to uh, maximize this one by changing this one, these parameters and click OK solve right so as you can see uh, we were able to get uh, same log likelihood and mu actually has been changed to actual uh, average so it's the same as uh, samples average for each variable that's how we uh, actually estimate parameters by maximum likelihood method for multivariate normal distribution i hope it was useful to understand how to uh, estimate parameters by maximum likelihood method in excel and r Please click like and subscribe if it was useful for you. Thank you.